What's up, everybody? So, um, on Q&A Thursday, somebody asked me for some weight loss tips, and I didn't respond because I wanted to really uh, answer that question thoroughly, and I wasn't feeling all that good, so I was answering more with text responses, and um, so I wanted to actually take the time and post like a good video for you guys and uh, for those that were asking, so here it is. Which, in regards to that question, I think that's an awesome question. You guys um, say a lot of really nice things to me on Q&A Thursday, which is awesome, but I love like the the questions asking for advice or asking something personal about myself or you know things like that um, I know a lot of you guys use it as a means of communication with me and I love the interaction which is why I engage and and repost the answers but uh, you know the questions like this are, are really kind of fun so if you guys ask more stuff like this uh, anything you know uh, weight loss things about me things about you know uh, my opinions on stuff whatever like those are pretty cool so um, anyway really appreciate this question I think it's a pretty good one so I think the key to weight loss and health in general is it all starts from the inside out. And I don't just mean nutrition, I mean like a, a healthy mind-body connection as well as a healthy digestive system. And one thing that I really, really believe in is when you're eating, actually enjoy your food. Take the time to taste it, actually enjoy it, chew it properly, don't allow distractions, don't talk while you're eating, don't be reading or watching TV like be there in the moment and actually enjoy your food because when you actually take the time to focus on what you're eating it's going to break down and digest better you're going to produce more natural enzymes in your saliva to to break it down and digest it better and that mind-body connection is going to allow it to partition the nutrients more efficiently and your body's going to utilize it more efficiently. you can ask any of my close friends they'll tell you i get pissed off when people distract me while i'm eating um so yeah focus on your food don't allow distractions and enjoy it now I'd say the next thing is to focus on your digestive health. So um, ways to do that would be, you know, eat more greens. If you can't eat more greens, get maybe like a greens powder and drink that in the morning. Um, eat more healthy fibers. You can try like a healthy cleanse or detox, something like that. Um, get a really good probiotic, which I really believe in. Um, for example, probiotics are really beneficial for digestive health as well as immune health. And uh, antibiotics, as great as they are when we're sick, they actually kill the good bacteria too. So. Um, you should replenish that with a healthy probiotic, and a lot of people don't do that. And uh, in turn, that's going to throw your digestive tract off balance. So um, focus on improving the mind-body connection and focus on improving the digestive system. Drink a lot more water and focus on your hydration. Um, I don't care what you say, you are probably not drinking enough water. So take your water intake and up it because uh, water is key. Drink a lot more water. Now, obviously, the next tip and one of the most important things is going to be your overall nutrition, which, um, you know, I personally don't follow a diet. I eat like shit, uh, but I can kind of do that and get away with it because I lead a very active lifestyle. Um, but my personal opinion on diet nutrition is it's all about trial and error, seeing what works best for you. And, you know, everybody's different. Everybody's going to have a different opinion. Um, but if I were to make a recommendation, I would say increase your protein intake, you know, consume healthy fats, limit your sugars. Um, you could try something like the keto diet. I mean, that works. You'll lose weight quick off of it. I don't personally think it's a, a, a long-term lifestyle to follow, but it does work. And we have a lot of uh, great keto products at GNC that you can stop in and we can help you out with. Um, but I'd say overall, best tip for nutrition I have is just to, to have a balanced diet. Balanced diet and moderation, um, which is what life's all about, right? Life's all about balance and moderation. So apply the same principles to the foods you eat and you'll see good results. Now, things you can do to supplement your diet, which I highly recommend, is get a good meal replacement or a good protein shake, something that's going to provide you some healthy fats, high protein, healthy fibers, and uh, you know you can do it as a meal if you can't eat, or you can do it in between meals, um, but meal replacements and protein shakes really do help uh, no matter what your goal is. So I would advise to pick up something like that, and uh, you know I have suggestions on those if you guys want to know my opinion on different supplements, um, but I'll save that for another topic, and uh, a good multivitamin too, something that you know, covers all your nutritional gaps and your bases that you can just take daily to to kind of help again supplement uh, your balanced diet. Now, as far as the workouts go, I would say step one is just consistency and to make sure you're getting there. That's definitely half the battle. Um, learn as much as you can about different workouts and, and whatnot, and find out what you like and what you're noticing your body works best with. But uh, what worked best for me when I used to bodybuild and do competitions was I would do fasted cardio on a treadmill um, every morning and I'll do it for 60 minutes and I'll put it on an incline and I would walk for 60 minutes at like a moderate pace and I wouldn't hold on to the rails don't hold on to the rails that's cheating you, know, you want to walk and, and be on that incline and and just get that metabolism going for the day and I loved doing it fasted because uh, 
you know, I just felt like that gave me the best results. So not saying necessarily you guys have to do that. You guys can find something that works for you, but I personally really enjoyed fasted cardio. Lift weights and protein is good, okay? So as far as lifting weights go, I personally really like doing these types of weight training exercises. I really like drop sets, supersets, and rest pause sets. You guys can Google those and see what they mean, but basically a superset is back-to-back -back exercises with minimal rest. Um, a drop set is where you do a burnout set and then lower the weight and immediately without rest go right into the same exercise again. And a rest pause is say like I'm trying to hit eight reps and I fail at six, I'll re-rack the weight for like five seconds and then I'll bang out those last two reps real quick. Um, my actual weight training workouts are very fast, very intense, and um, everything's basically a burnout set. You know, the key is to get that burn, and when you feel that burn, keep it going. Keep that burn alive, don't stop. Think of it like this, like the hotter it burns, the harder it hardens, okay? Lift the weight off. Lifting weights is good. Now, if you're a woman and you think you're gonna get bulky or turn into a bodybuilder, you won't, okay? Lifting weights won't bulk you up like that. Unless that's your goal and you're really trying to bulk up, you know? Lifting weights is not going to make you bulky. It's not going to turn you into a man or anything like that, okay? So lift weights, weights is, weights are good. Now, if you are trying to bulk up, lifting weights can bulk you up, but you really got to be trying. So if you're trying to put on weight and trying to, to gain muscle, you know, do more compound movements, increase your calories, eat more. Um, but that's not what this uh, question is about. It's about weight loss. And uh, I just want to stress lifting weights does help, okay? So lift weights. Now, this is one of my favorite tips. Find an activity that you personally enjoy that keeps you active, okay? So for me, I play hockey every Tuesday. I play on three teams. It's really intense. It's intense cardio. That helps boost my metabolism. It helps keep the weight off, you know? It's, it's a sport. It's an athletic. I love playing, and uh, it helps keep me in shape. So you can find a sport that you enjoy, or you can take a dance class. Um, you could take an aerobics class or something at your gym, find a class that you like. Uh, go walking with friends or something, make it like a social gathering, uh, find a partner that motivates you, do, you know, do things in groups or with a friend. But, uh, you know, I, I think finding an activity that you can do daily or not even daily, but weekly that'll help keep you active is very key for me. It's hockey for me. It's also dancing. Um, so find something like that, that you enjoy and, uh, sign up. I also really like kettlebell circuits. I used to do those too. Kettlebells are intense, so you can try kettlebell exercises. I really like those. Now, I know I said I wasn't gonna get too deep into supplements on this video, but um, the next thing I'd say is get yourself some good supplements. I really do believe in vitamins and, and other products, and I personally take a ton of stuff myself. Obviously, I work at GNC, and uh, I only take and trust products that I personally sell in my stores. So I'd say go to your local owned family GNC, talk to somebody there. They can offer you a ton of good advice. And if you guys want any more advice on that from me, uh, drop a couple questions about it on next week's Q&A Thursday because uh, I'd love to answer them and show you guys some stuff that I personally like and enjoy. Focus on improving your sleep, lowering your stress, and reducing your body's inflammation. Okay, Those three things will hold you back if you don't have them in check. All right, guys, I think that just about does it for this video. So thank you for watching. I hope that was useful for you guys. And um, any more questions that you have regarding this topic or any other topics, drop those questions on next week's Q&A Thursday, and I'll try to give you guys another good video response. So thanks for watching. Have a good night.